Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to Rob Motive JT. Today we have a mod, really an accessory, to add to the new Toyota Tundra. If you're new here, please go ahead and click that subscribe button. Going to be lots of things coming up on this truck, including a pretty long distance trip, but that's a little far in the future. Anyway, I have a new mod. It's a must have for the Toyota Tundra. It came in the other day, actually yesterday, I think sitting right there in the box and you might think well gee that looks a little bit small for what it is but it folds into fourths if you will and i actually have the same thing in the toyota tacoma and i found it for the price to be a pretty darn good deal for what it is so we're going to go ahead unbox it i'm going to switch you over to hat cam and hopefully not give you vertigo by moving all over the place too quickly. I've had a couple of complaints about that in the past, so I'm going to try to take it nice and slow. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, first thing we need to do, pop open the gate. I always forget that this is now electronic. I always try to grab and pull on this thing. You don't need to do that. So what it is, obviously, is going to be a bed mat. It is a must for the Toyota Tundra or any, uh, or the Tacoma I should say, because we have the plastic composite bed in here and it is like ice. So this thing, uh, as I mentioned, comes in force. There will be, it's all one piece, it just kind of unfolds. Uh, but there will be a link down below in case you want to check it out. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead, let's see, we need to grab a knife or something. Uh, let's choose this one today. Go ahead and pop this thing open. Again, I don't think you can beat this for the price. Let's see, that side is stapled. Although, we do need to cut the corner, I guess. Be careful not to cut the, the mat itself. Obviously, that would ruin your day. Well, it would ruin my day, anyway, if... Uh, if I manage to do that. Now, let's go ahead and whip it out of here. This thing is relatively heavy. I was kind of surprised when I went out to pick it up. Of course, it is bigger than what the Tacoma has, so it's going to be heavier than the Tacoma. Make sure, yes, we've got nothing inside there. Get that out of the way. Get a little bit of fan action over here. It is uh, 87 degrees right now in the garage. So, not as bad as it has been, that's for sure. All right, it is hermetically sealed. You know, that's important when you have a bed mat. Oh, I take that back. One side is open. That's good. That'll make life a little bit easier. Put that away, because I'll forget. Now, let's go ahead. Whip it out of here. Hopefully it is the right one. You know, you always run a risk when you buy anything these days, it seems. And then I mentioned it's folded in force. And you'll notice you won't have any problems with that uh, because of the sun. The sun will flatten this thing out. It did in the Tacoma, and it should lay in there pretty nicely. Now, the way I'm going to do it, I'm just going to kind of throw it back on the side steps and go ahead and slip it in there you go it's just that easy now i am gonna crawl up on top let's go ahead and put our well i guess you have to do this by hand put our step down that probably gets easier over time i would guess but i've been doing it by hand out of necessity i think but let's crawl up here i'm just gonna kind of walk around on it a little bit kind of try to flatten it out a little Again, you will see this thing completely flatten out uh, once it sits out in the sun. Particularly if you live in an area like I do, and it gets very, very hot here. Now, fitment-wise, uh, it looks like it fits really well to me. Even has the little nubs that come out to go into the slots behind the wheel wells. And of course, you have to have the nubs in the front uh, to go in front of the wheel wells. But if you look, it gives you nice coverage over the edges. Seems to be pretty uniform everywhere. And it's not too long in the back. Just enough to clear where the gate is going to close. So it looks like a really good fit to me. 
Now, the other thing, see if I can get down out of here without falling or something crazy. Let's go ahead and put this back up. That does kind of spring back up, by the way. Now, it does have a pretty nice kind of rubbery surface as compared to what you get with the uh, bed itself. Again, it is a composite bed. You can probably tell by the sound. The good thing about this is that it is uh, in four pieces, if you will, or it folds. If you need to take it out for some reason, maybe to clean the bed or whatever, you can simply fold it over, fold it into a fourths, and set it aside. You don't have this big giant thing you have to kind of screw with that doesn't want to go any different way, right? Now, just to check, we're going to go out and look in the back of the Tacoma. Again, it's the same kind of bed mat. I'm not sure if it's the same brand, but we're going to take a look at it and see how it's laying down now that it's been sitting around out here in the sunshine and the heat uh, for quite a while actually. And let's take a look. You can see inside there it is nice and flat. No pieces or parts sticking up or anything crazy like that. This is what that one is going to look like after it sits out here and kind of relaxes in the sun a little bit. Now, let's take one more quick look at it. I wanted to see what it looks like uh, from ground level, if you will, as opposed to standing in the bed. Just to see, yeah, nice good fit. Again, I know it looks wavy and stuff, but it will settle once it heats up out in the sun. And in a future video, I will do just a real quick blurb of it so that you guys can see what it looks like out there after it's actually relaxed a little bit. Okay, that's it. A must-have, really, mod or accessory for the Toyota Tundra simply because of that composite bed. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Have you gotten this particular kind before? Maybe not the manufacturer, but the style that folds? Or did you go OEM and spend the extra money? I'd just be curious to know. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Bye.